Hello, we are going to be doing a demo on the Aqua Bug. That is this vehicle here. So, once you get the product, if you're buying it from Casper, it will be a Casper card. That's why it says no transfer. Um, once you get the Casper card, you'll right click, add it to your avatar. Let me go ahead and show it to you real quick. Add it to your avatar. You'll hit buy now. It'll be free. And um, you'll hit accept. So when you get ready to do re-delivery, don't go through the marketplace. Go to your pick and play HUD that it comes with. And then it will look like this. Hit re-delivery. It'll open up to another page. You can re-deliver it through there. Once you get the product, you'll unpack the box. It'll be called this right here, Aqua um, Bug Box. What I like to do is add the HUD first. So we got Aqua Bug Driver HUD version 4. Right click add to your avatar. This is it down here. Once you get that, go to version 2. It's the latest when this video was made. So we'll go ahead, res out. Make sure nothing shows up here saying you can't res. As I res it on myself. Now, usually it'll land about right here in the water. That is just a little above where it will be floating. Now, once you have your vehicle out, go ahead and turn off your AO. If you have this type of AO, I suggest you detach it. Because I've had AOs break on me and crossing sims only been that style though so once you are sitting you can open your doors and once you sit your HUD will come up if you want it to close you just click it it'll disconnect to reconnect to it just left click when you left click on the boat you'll get places to sit and you'll get controls for the boat so you don't have to actually have your HUD on to control the boat but the HUD is nice to have for all your other features so let's go ahead and show this real quick um, to show the furniture that you see in the pictures left click on furniture everything will show up now when people boat by or you're boating You'll notice none of this gets hit by anything and things go right through it. To stop that from happening, you have a surfboard. When you left click on the surfboard, the surfboard and two solids come out of the vehicle and cover just the buoys and this so you can walk across both areas. This is a three sitter designed for two people. The third sitter is for a captain boat stay. Um, Captain Boat Stays are alts that people usually make to prevent their vehicle from disappearing. If you are wanting to do the standing fishing on these spots or just don't want the chairs here, hit the orange furniture and just the orange chairs will disappear. Hit it again, they come back. If you're planning on DJing, doing music, left click the button here. Let me zoom in on that and that will toggle this right here. Go ahead and zoom in. When you first click it, you'll have this message come up. Tuner Gay FM Radio. When you click it, let's go ahead and show it to you. It'll open up another page. It comes on really loud, so I closed it real quick. To modify it. Now, if my vehicle disappears, I'll res it out and go back to it again. It has three minutes here. Stream. Go to stream, you change out Gay FM with your own radio stream or your own radio station and save it. You can also, let me show you one more time, I'm sorry. That's number one line, radio. And where you saw that text, um, to change or stream, edit me. To change your stream, edit me. That's where this line is. Just so y'all see that. Oops. Okay. For the ice chest. And let me go ahead and change my sits to one that's out here real quick. 
So you'll notice if you do a sit like this and you're sitting in, just you know, open the door. If your engine is out like this, you can just close it and it'll put your engine away. On the drinks, the left side, you'll get a pop-up menu. Let's do 7-Up. You'll hit yes for auto-attach. It will auto-attach to your avatar. You hit just drink. It, um, this drink will take one sip and disappear. You hit drink all. It'll take each sip. This works with your Xeo Life HUD system. It's a free HUD system. It's in the pick and play HUD or your television here if you want to check it out. If you don't want a timer, just close it out and it will stay on you until you actually detach it or left click and hit drink again. Now when an item detaches off you, if it does this, you can just go to your animation, you're on sitter 5, go to 5, voila. If you're in a no res area, hit the right side, except you get a folder of all the drinks and ice creams, everything. And when you're done, you just delete it. You click the button again to toggle it off. On, sorry, my camera is going a little wonky. Let me move my avatar again. On the television, all you have to do is you have the on button, turns on the TV, turns off the TV. You can change the textures on this side or the back side, it's up to you. To activate the TV, just left click the screen. It'll take you to the pick and play home screen. If you want to do a movie, just click movies or TV shows and it has you know everything you want. None of these movies are uploaded or streamed by me. These are all open public URL links. So, you don't have that to worry about. You also have streaming radios for everything. When you're done, you can hit home. If you want to watch externally, you can click that. Volume control there, YouTube, landmarks, all that fun stuff. To change the paint job, We'll show you where this is up. So, remember, top of van is your green, yellow, so red. So, you can have a lot of fun with just, you know, going around and changing. See, we got Scooby Doo look over here now. Isn't that cool? Okay, so when you're done, and you're ready to go travel, all you have to do is go to driver. Let's go ahead and shut off the furniture. You can close your doors. So whether your door is open or closed, so in this case, you can Sorry, I'm not sure what's going on with this all right now. There it goes. So, whether your motor is out or put up, you can manually pull it out if you want. If you don't want to and it's put away. Take your out. I'm bring down my sound, but I think that might be a little loud for the speakers. And for the roof, you can open up the roof as well. You've got a map in here that tells you the full sim, the direction you're facing on it. And these doors do open as well. Ah. You do that, that means you're hitting those invisible roofs. So don't forget those invisible items out. So we go into reverse and fill up my mini map, other mini map. And you want to just kind of hide that, you can. As you can see, let me 
Go forward. You can see the motor turn. This is gear one, gear two. Now remember, you got all these items here. Watch as we go right by this dock. You'll notice we won't hit any item with a solid. It goes right through, no issues. So you don't have to worry about boats or you hitting anything. Um, when that surfboard's put away, that is what will happen. It'll just go right through it. That was a. Oh, yeah. I think SL just broke my vehicle. If it does that, just right click, sit, start up again. With all the new updates SL's been doing, it's been doing weird stuff on sim crossing sometimes for me. First time with this vehicle. easy to control when you get up to land you can see you can go up a little bit so there you go not too hard to get up out of the water and that is that